Hello, welcome back to Think with Digital. Sometimes for our business or projects, we have to manage our invoices or billing systems. In ClickUp, you can manage and build your invoices. But currently, ClickUp doesn't have a built-in invoicing feature within the platform. Today, I'm going to show you a few ways to handle invoicing in ClickUp. First, navigate to your workspace and to your workspace. Once you do that, you will find this customize section from here. Click on customize. Go to fills. Tap on new column. Here in the new column section, you can create new fields for your invoice or bills. You can capture invoice related information such as client details, invoice numbers, amounts due, due dates and payment status. Now scroll down until you find task. Now once you enter to add task, you have to enter name one by one. Here I will enter all of my clients informations. Turn on the create roll-up fields here and then go to select field, tap on priority and then you can custom your name from here. After doing all of this, tap on add column. Like this, I'm going to add more information of my clients and I will save it in the tasks. Now, after adding all of your informations, again go to your fields and you can see in the show or hide section, I have created all the informations about my clients. Now to make this as an invoice, go to customize, tap on use existing field. Now you can see all of my informations are recorded in the custom field manager. Now if you want to rename any of this task, you can go to this three dots option and then just tap on rename. Then you will be able to rename and also you can change your field type. To delete any of this information, you can again go to this three dots option from here and just tap on delete. Now again go to customize section and now we will go to fills. Then click on new column and you can see there are different kinds of option here. Text, text area, date, number, checkbox, email and files also. In the document section. You can attach documents to task or spaces. You can also create invoice documents as a PDF or Word file and you can attach them to re relevant tasks or I will tap on documents section. I will add one of my files here. So I will tap on files. Then tap on your field name. And tap on add column. Again, go to your files, tap on use existing field. You can also set up reminders and notifications in the ClickUp to ensure, to ensure you don't miss any invoice due dates or follow-ups. For that, you will have to follow the same process. You have to go to the fields and then go to new column and you will find a date section here. Just put your field name that you have put for the other informations as well and then just tap on date and you will be able to then just and tap on your field name that you have also put for your other client's information. And then just tap on add column. Once you go to your location of your file, once you go to your location of the workspace, you will find your file section, emails, you will find your emails, your attached files, and also your other text informations. 
to set the reminders go to your specific list tap on the edit and you will be able to find your dates where you can put your due dates or any reminders that you want just go to the dates tap on the date Tap on the start date. After setting up the start time and ending time, tap on set recording and then tap on save. And you're all done. While ClickUp doesn't have a dedicated invoice feature out of the box, its flexibility allows you to adapt it to your invoicing workflow by leveraging the custom fields, attachments, reminders. This approach can help you streamline your invoicing process and keep it organized within your project management platform. That's it for today. You can monitor your outstanding invoices, payment statuses, and revenue streams. Let us know you let us know if you have any questions with custom fields on ClickUp. That's it for today. We will see you in the next tutorial.